This is a bow and arrow. When drawn, it can store potential energy, and when released, it can shoot the arrow. However, each time you draw and release the bow, it takes two and a half minutes, so you can't attack enemies quickly and continuously. You, being clever, have made some improvements to it. First, you turn the bow horizontally and place it on a wooden support, put the arrows in a box and place it on top, then add a connecting rod to link the arrow box and the wooden support. A groove is cut in the middle of the arrow box and the bowstring is placed in it. When the connecting rod is pushed forward, it moves the arrow box forward and the bowstring falls into the groove at the back. When the connecting rod is pulled back, the bowstring is pulled back with it. When the connecting rod is pulled to the end, the bowstring will hit the rod and be lifted, thereby releasing the arrow. When the rod is pulled back, the arrow in the box will drop, waiting for the next launch. This way, you can quickly fire continuously. Congratulations, you have just successfully invented the Zug repeating crossbow. So you take the crossbow to attack the enemy, but they have more advanced compound bows. These bows have a complex pulley system and an effective range of up to hundreds of meters. Before you get close to the enemy, they have already skewered you, turning you into roast chicken.